When it comes to Oklahoma football history, there are so many names that come to mind. It would be quite hard to list them all. And when you stand in the presence of one of these outstanding individuals, you know there is an air of greatness that surrounds them. With former OU quarterback great Jamel Holloway, there is no exception. As the old saying goes, it's hard to keep a good man down. But some men refuse to get knocked down in the first place. The only senior in that secondary, Holloway, same play. This time he sheds a tackle in midfield, breaks another one. He's down the sideline. McMillan tries to knock him out of bounds. He's still going inside. The fact that Oklahoma doesn't throw that much could be deceiving. Very productive. Here's Holloway on second attempt at the 46. He's to the 40, the 30, 25. Recently, Mr. Holloway took a group of Muscogee Creek Nation and other Native American youths to Norman, Oklahoma to watch the annual spring game and to get to meet many of the OU football heroes of the past and the present. For Jamel, it was a time of catching up and introducing old friends. For the kids, it was a moment they will never forget. We had approximately about 25, 27 kids uh, it was about 20 on the bus, and seven met us down there in Norman, uh, along with their parents. Um, it was a it was a good day, uh, kind of cold, but we had. A, I hope the kids had a nice time. Everybody was happy, smiling, tired on the way back home. So I know that um, we did something good today. You forgot your ticket. Right, it was exciting meeting Jamel Holloway. I had a really good time. I had a fun time hanging around with him, meeting these fans, getting to meet all the football players and stuff like that. Um, this is going on our eighth year. Um, thank God. Um, and we've moved it around. It just used to be in Little uh, Walika. It started in Walika and now it's, it's, it's blossoming to Eufaula, Morris, and Bristol. And so we picked up two extra days, and uh, it's just a, a pleasure to work with um, all, all kids, all types of walk that they do. Uh, but most of all, the kids today were very mannerable. You know, re they respected all elders. You know, there wasn't any horse playing going on, and um, good character kids. And to see kids come from all over Oklahoma just to go to this little function. We had a, we had a young lady um, come all the way from Jay, Oklahoma, to come to join, to come to join this. And she had to get up at 4 o'clock in the morning just to be here at 6 o'clock. So, you know, if we can reach out and touch some kids to, be, to have them come do that, that's pretty good. I mean, it was fun, but like from a girl's perspective, we don't really know like a lot about football unless you spend a lot of time with like boys. But it was it was like a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun with my friends. Um, well, you know, I just I call upon a lot of my friends when it comes to the coaching world, or whether it comes to when we're down in Norman, just to ask them to come and say something to the kids. Um, very happy that Sterling Shepard, Adrian Peterson, uh, Jason White and a couple of other players that was former OU players and, and today's player, Mr. Murray, the quarterback. Um, he came up and spoke to the kids and um, I was pretty, I was really happy about that. It, it was very exciting. I got to see the Bob Stoop stat, uh, statue. And then I like how we walked around seeing like kind of the campus and the game was really fun. We got to meet players that it would be really hard to meet. And it was really fun and exciting. I guess the way to to get involved is just go to Creek Nation and, and ask them about our football camp and what might they can do for the kids. Because this is all about the kids in these rural areas and um, trying to get ahead and just want to teach them um, to try to be respectable men and women. Y'all keep him on the straight and narrow, man. Everybody stay in school. Love you all. Because I have kids. I do it because um, somebody helped me. 
I didn't have a father, and um, a coaches took me under their wings. And um, all I can do right now is is take some of the kids under my wings. I figure if you have three or more kids, three to thirty, as I say, it's all we all gonna have fun. Whether it's just three of us or it's thirty of us, we gonna have fun. We gonna enjoy the day and uh, and just enjoy one another's company. Well, I'm looking forward to going to college there. Great education to get in there. It's all about giving back to the kids because um, we supposed to be their role models and they're the ones gonna have to lead us sooner or later, you know? And so to be able to give back to different communities and, and just help them in whatever kind of way, I'm happy. Thank you, Mr. Holloway. Thank you. Is lethal. Holloway, he may be gone. He's around the right side of the tent. He's going to sprint for it, and he gets there. Did not even make the trip. Holloway keeping the ball out of the option, turns the corner with it, and will score. Let's see if Holloway can throw. No, he's going to run the corner.